Well, from middle school to med school, graduation ceremonies are being delayed or even outright canceled. And even for those going into healthcare, the typical med school graduations right now, they just are not happening. But one Jacksonville man's family had a different idea for their son as he earned his medical degree. And David Jones has his heartwarming story that you'll see only on First Coast News. Yeah, I just knew ever since I was a kid I wanted to be a doctor. After graduating from FSU, Jack's native Elias Farah took that mentality to med school. Some grueling years later, he's ready now to start his residency after, of course, his hooding ceremony. And the hooding ceremony is basically just showing that, yeah, now you are a doctor. With coronavirus limiting travel, Farah's planned graduation in New York was canceled. So when his mom asked him to take pictures outside their house on the day he would have been handed his diploma, this was the last thing he expected. Honestly, my heart was pounding. I was so happy. I was like, every single car that passed by, I was like, Cousins, friends, neighbors, people I never met before, like we're just running through. There was there was probably like 50 cars going through. But I, I got pretty emotional when I saw my friends and all my family and every every car that rolled by, I was pointing. You could see me pointing. Like I was just shocked that they all showed up. And it was just you know it was it was just great. It, um, my mom keeps watching the video over and over again. I hear those 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 uh <laughs> those four talking. Farrow will begin his residency at UF Health in Jacksonville in July, ready to serve his hometown during and after a difficult time. It's definitely a little nerve wracking. You know, you're a little worried that once you go to the hospital, you know, about exposure to yourself, exposure to your friends and family. But you know, I'm excited. I'm ready. Um, I'm ready to go out there. I'm ready to help people and I'm ready to stop being in school and really apply the skills that I've learned. You know, PAs, nurse practitioners, anyone in the healthcare field, that's basically our calling. We want to help people and that's what I want to do. David Jones, First Coast News, on your side. Oh, what a great memory. And to everyone in the healthcare industry, thank you for being right there on the front lines.